Now uh, isn't it sixteen six twenty twenty four? Yes, sixteen six. These are the videos. Ma'am, should I share yes, the PDF I have it downloaded? Ma'am, even I have. Yes, you can show, beta. Just wait, 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 wait. I have got. Yes. This was Anna. See. If angle A and angle B are acute angles such hmm. that sin A is equal to sin B, then Ma show that angle A is equal to angle B. This type of question we have already done? Ma'am, it is not Ma 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 Cos A is equal to cos B. Have you remembered? Ma'am, Ma Ma is in an explorer. Yes, beta? Ma'am, Ma it is still, it is still stuck now. See. I'm going to explain just wait. Sin A is equal to sin B. A and B are acute angles. This is your right angle triangle, right, Vida? It means your right angle will be at C. A and B. Right? Now the find PDF the value of shown. sine A. Ma'am. Yes, PDF Vita. is not. Ma'am, your screen is not being shown. Screen is not visible. Yes, ma'am. Now it's visible? Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma yes, ma yes, here. Now sine A. What was the short trick for finding sine A? Pandit, Badri Prasad, Har Har Bole, or... Pakistan, Bhuka, Pyasa, Hindustan, Harabara, right? So, first ratio is for sine theta. It means perpendicular upon hypotenuse. So, when your angle is at A, then what will be your sine A? Tell me, children. Perpendicular is BC. And your hypotenuse is AB, right? Speak, children. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Now you are looking at this point B. Now we have to find the value of sine B. Right? So opposite angle of 90 degree should be B. Now this is your perpendicular and this is your hypotenuse. Right? Now again find perpendicular upon hypotenuse. What is your perpendicular? AC. Hypotenuse is AB. Now we have given sine A is equal to sine B. Right. So, BC upon AB is equal to AC upon AB. AB, AB cancels and BC is equal to AC. So, BC is equal to AC. It means it becomes isosceles triangle. And we know that angles supposed to equal sides are equal. It means your angle A will be equal to which angle? What angle we have B. to prove? Yes, angle A will be equal to angle B because the opposite angle of BC is angle A and the opposite angle of AC is B. So, angle A will be equal to angle B. So, hence proof. Understood? Yes. Um, can we do it like assuming a angle A is equal to angle B? This thing we have to prove. How you will solve then then? Ma'am, like, ma we have to do sin A is equal to sin B. So, I, I assume angle A is equal to angle Where? B. Yes, ma'am. Am I audible, ma'am? Yes, ma'am. Next question is, 
इनर ट्राइंगल पी क्यू आर राइट एंगल एट क्यू पी आर प्लस क्यू आर एज ट्वेंटी फाइव पी आर प्लस पी आर प्लस क्यू आर एज ट्वेंटी फाइव एंड पी क्यू एज फाइव सेंटीमीटर and right angle at q so now make the triangle first of all i have already told you that in each and every question of trigo you have to make right angle triangle so p q r because right angle at q am i audible children yes ma'am yes, yes ma'am ma yes ma'am okay now p q is given 5 cm so let qr and pr these are unknown okay so apply the pythagoras theorem first so according to the pythagoras theorem pythagoras pq square plus qr square will be equal to pr square right beta perpendicular square plus base square is equal to hypotenuse so now pqs you can write now we have to find what we have to find we have to find we have given pr plus qr so we will shift this qr to the right hand side so pq square will be equal to pr square minus qr now here you will apply the identity a square minus b square which is equal to a plus b and a minus b right beta प्रॉपर्टी राइट सो ट्वेंटी फाइव इज इक्वल Now PR plus QR is given how much? Twenty five. Twenty five. So you will write here twenty five, right? So PR minus QR. So now value of PR minus QR is one. This is your equation one. And second equation we have already given that PR plus QR is equal to twenty five. This is your NCERT question, beta. Now you can apply elimination method. Because Q R Q R both are having alternate sign, so subtract them. Then P R plus P R is twice P R is equal to twenty five plus one twenty six. Then P R is equal to twenty six by two thirteen. Right? Then value of P R is thirteen centimeter. Now we have given this condition that P R plus Q R is equal to twenty five. Now P R is thirteen plus Q R is equal to twenty five, so it implies value of Q R is twelve centimeter. Understood? Now this is your thirteen centimeter and this is twelve centimeter. Understood, children? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Tell me, children, have you understood this question? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Am I audible? Yes, yes, ma'am. Ma yes, ma'am. So, Mok Sudhanshu, Siddish. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, children. I was disconnected due to network issue. So all have understood. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Mm. Okay. So do you want to note it down it or may I proceed to next question? Tell me. Ma'am, ma just one minute, ma'am. Okay, okay. Ma'am, this is test question only, ma'am. Yes, beta. Test. I am discussing. 
धृति अंडरस्टूड बेटा यस मैम डन मैम थैंक यू ओके बेटा सो मोक डन यस मैम सुधांशु यस मैम काश्वी सिद्धार्थ प्रण्या प्रण्या इज नॉट देयर मेहर मेहर डन बेटा अभिनव आर्यन यस मैम यस मैम ओके नाउ नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वाज It was evaluate two ten square forty five. This question also I think we did in the class only. Yes. Have you remembered two ten square forty five? Two ten square forty five degree minus. प्लस कॉ स्क्वायर थर्टी माइनस साइन स्क्वायर सिक्सटी प्लस टू कॉ स्क्वायर थर्टी माइनस साइन स्क्वायर सिक्सटी नाउ फुट द वैल्यूज टेन स्क्वायर टेन फोर्टी फाइव है यस बेटा हम इट इज कॉ स्क्वायर थर्टी नॉट टू फुट कॉ स्क्वायर यस कॉ स्क्वायर थर्टी So ten ten forty five is one beta. So one square cos thirty. Tell me, children, value of cos thirty and sine sixty. Two three by two. Two three by two. Yes, both are having same value. Good beta. So you will write two into root three by two whole square minus. Root three by two whole square. So two ones are is two plus root three square is three divided by two square is four. Right now same root three square is three divided by four. Now solve it. Two ones are two. Two two ja four. So two plus three by two minus three by. Now take the LCM children four. Then four two ja is eight plus six minus three. So eight plus six is fourteen minus three. Fourteen minus three is eleven by. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Okay, beta. Show me your thumbs up only. If you don't want to unmute yourself, just show me your thumbs up. Right. Fine. Now next is. See, root three sine theta is equal to cos theta. Then find the value of root three sine theta is equal to cos theta. See. Root three sine theta is equal to cos theta. Then find three cos square theta plus two upon three cos square theta plus two cos theta upon three cos theta plus two plus two cos theta upon three cos theta plus two. So now, see, root three sine theta is equal to cos theta. I have given, right? So what you can do, beta, you will divide both the sides by cos theta. Then it will be root three sine theta upon cos theta is equal to what? Got it, this step, beta? Tell me, children. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Now. 
sin theta upon cos theta is tan theta and tan theta is equal to 1 upon root theta. Can you write like this? Tell me. Do you like write like this? Tan theta is equal to 1 by root 3. By shifting this root 3 to the denominator of right hand side. Tell me children. Yes ma'am. Yes ma'am. Now check the table and tell me at which angle the value of tan theta is 1 upon root 3. 30 degrees ma'am. Yes, 30 degrees. So, 10 theta is equal to 10, 30. So, on comparing, you will get value of theta is 30. So, just put the value of theta in this. So, 3 cos square 30 degree plus 2 cos 30 upon 3 cos 30 plus 2. Okay. So, now 3 cos square 30 Recently, just you told me value of cos 30 is root 3 by 2. You people has told me. And then 2 cos 30, 2 into root 3 by 2. Upon 3 cos 30, it means 3 root 3 by 2. Plus 2. Right? 2, 2. Cancel. Then 3 into root 3 square is 3. 2, 2, ja 4. Plus root 3. Upon. 3 root 3 plus 2 by 2 to ja. Now multiply 3 3 ja 9 by 4 plus root 3 upon 3 root 3 plus 8 by 2. Now you can take LCM in the numerator. So it will be 9 plus 4 root 3 by 4 and 3 root 3 plus 8 by right so you can write 2 to ja is 4 so 9 plus 4 root 3 upon 3 root 3 plus 8 and 1 by 8. now children you can further solve it by rationalizing it so are you able to rationalize tell me or may i show it ma'am you can show it you can do it, Aryan, Abhinav, Siddharth, Moksha, Diti, Meher. I'm can you show it? May I show? Yes, ma'am. Okay, then. So, how you will rationalize? You will multiply and divide numerator and denominator by root 3 by 3 minus 8. Right? See, 1 by 2. 9 plus 4 root 3 upon 3 root 3 plus 8 multiply 3 root 3 minus 8 upon 3 root 3 minus 8. <laughs> this is already 4. Bit of 4. This is 4, not 8. This is 4, 4, 4. Okay. So now, 1 by 2. Multiply 9 into 3. 27 root 3. 4, 3 ja. 12 root 3 into 3 is 3. 9, 4 ja. 36. Plus minus 4, 4 ja. 16 root 3. Divided by. Now, in the numerator, A plus B and A minus B. So you will write. 3 root 3 whole square minus 4 whole square. Right, beta? So, 1 by 2, 27 minus 16. What you will get? Tell me, 27 minus 16. 11. Yes, 12, 3 is 36, 36. So, 0. Divided by 3 root 3. 3 root 3, multiply 3 root 3. 3, 3, 9, 3, 27, minus 60, right? So, 1 by 2, 11 root 3 by 11. 11, 11 cancel, answer will be root 3. Got it, Peter? 
Yes, ma'am. Can you show the yes, second yes, question? Yes, sir. Is it that? Second question's first bit, ma'am. Can you show it again? Which one? Second question's first bit, ma'am. It's first bit. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Just wait. The two tan square forty five. Yeah. See. Is it visible, Abina? Its value is eleven by four. Yes. Ma'am, you wrote the question wrong. Where? In second question. Just wait. Let me see the question again. It was two ten square forty five plus cos square. Okay, I have written two more, right? One more two times. The answer. Is I guess two. the value is two, right? Yes, you can solve. Yes. So you can do this question like this. Just remove the two from here. Right, Bita? See. So it will be two plus three by four minus three by four. So answer will be two. Okay. Yes. So children, have you understood this question? Yes, ma'am. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Ma can you show the three yes, third one? You want to note down? Yes, children, tell me, do you want to note it down? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, Kashmi. Actually, I was out of station. That's why I have not taken your class since Tuesday. Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Okay, now next is, so children, your uh, class will be on Sunday also at 12 noon. Okay, ma'am. Ma'am, I will not yeah, be able to attend on Sunday. Yes, Vita, Abhina? Ma'am, I will not be able to attend on Sunday. Why? Ma'am, I have a family gathering. Okay. Then I will ask, okay, Manisha, ma'am. Okay, Vita? All are available on Sunday? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Now, next question. You can easily solve it. 10 theta is equal to 3 by 4. Then find the value of 1 minus cos theta plus 1 plus cos theta. Now, you can ask me your question in which you are having doubt. Meher? Meher has left? Ma'am, I am there. Okay. So, Meher, ask me. Your Ma doubt, Peter? Ma'am, my doubt is fourth bit, second one. Same one. Fourth ma cos the second A one plus cost. B. This question, Peter? Yes, ma'am. Cos A plus B is equal to and sine A minus B is equal to three, uh, 3. Then find the values of A and B where Actually, this question I was saying that while making the PDF, its digits are not properly changed. So the value of sine A minus B was root 3 by 2. So cos A plus B is equal to 0. It means A plus B is equal to 90 beta because value of cos, value of cos is 0 at 90 degree angle. Your screen is not visible. Now it is visible. Yes, ma'am. See, cos A plus B is given 0. So at which angle the value of cos is 0? 90 degree, right? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma so A plus B is equal to 90 degree. 
right and in second sin a minus b in the question it is written 3 but it was root 3 by 2 okay so i will give you marks for this okay children so the at which angle the value of sine will be root 3 by 2 60 degree so it will be 60 now you have got the two equations right so a plus b is equal to 90 and a minus b is equal to 60 just solve them then 2a is equal to 75 uh, 150 then value of a is 75 then value of b will be 90 minus 75 15 degree Okay, beta. Okay, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Don't worry. Those who have submitted, I will give you the extra marks. Okay, for this question. Ma'am, what about the fifth one? Fifth, fifth one. one. Okay, let me check also. Hard. Fifth first one. What was your fifth question? Sine theta is equal to twelve. So you can write sine theta. Mom, your screen is stuck again. Just wait. Have you tried to solve those questions, Peter? This one and uh, fifth one? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma okay. Because in board also, if any Double. question is wrong, and if any question is given from the outside, from deleted portion, then the CBSE will give you the marks only when you will attend that question, okay? If you will leave the question, if you left the question, then no marks will be given. So, in this, sine theta was is equal to 1 by 2. Instead of 12, it was 1 by 2. Now, children, your all doubts are clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, yes ma'am. Ma Ma'am, can the value of sine theta even be 12? No. Because if the value of sine theta will be 12, then it is not possible that its hypotenuse would be 1. Right, Peter? Okay, ma'am. Because hypotenuse will have la largest number. Okay? Largest dimension. Okay, ma'am. Can you once explain the sixth first one? Sixth one. Okay. Just wait. If cosec a is equal to root 3, the uh, root 2, this one, beta. Yes, ma'am. See, beta. Cosec a is equal to root 3. Then value of a will be? Ma'am? Yes. Value of a will be? Uh, this one. Now, what is the answer of this one again? See, question number 6, first part. It is a secant a is equal to root 2. So, at which angle the value of secant a is root 2? 45 beta? So, you yes, can write secant 45. So, value of a is 45 degree. Understood this? Yes, now, we have to find the value of 2 sin square a Plus 3 cot square a divided by 4 10 square a minus cos square a. Right, beta? So, just put the value of a 45. So, 2 sin square, it means sin 45 is 1 by root 2 whole square. Cot square 45 is 1 divided by 4 into 10 square is 1 minus cos 45 is 1 by root. So, 1 by root 2 whole square. Now, solve it. 2 sin square, so 2 into 1 by 2 plus 3 divided by 4 into 1 minus 1 by 2. Okay. So, 2 to cancel 3 plus 1, 4 divided by 4. So, 1 minus 1 by 2, it will be? 1 by 2 only, 4, 4 cancels, so answer will be 2. 
Understood? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So now all have got their doubts clear? Yes, so now we will meet on Sunday at 12 noon. Okay, children? Or if there will be change in timing, then I will let you inform. Okay? Okay, yes, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Ma'am, thank you. What is the fifth question? What is the fifth answer for the fifth question, ma'am? Which one, Vita Abhina? Answer for the fifth question. Answer of the fifth question. This uh, sine theta is equal to, this is 1 by 2, not 12. Then we have to show it. The value of this is 0. So we are getting marks for that, right? Yes, yes. I will give you. Okay. Only I will give marks to only those students, those who have attempted. Okay. Ma'am, I attempted, but I did not put it because it has. Ah, it's so okay. Many. Then I will give you. I will give you a bit. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Okay. Bye bye, children. You, now we will meet on Sunday. Thank bye. You, Thank you, ma'am. Bye, beta. Bye bye.